Last time on the Iron Mammal Progress series, I did a bunch of raids, but only got a Dexterous Prayer Scroll, sadly. I then worked on my Master Combat Achievement Diaries, and luckily I got them all done, so I now have the Verzik Slayer Helmet. Last episode, I mostly focused on raids, and on this one, I'd like to shift my focus back to Nex. Now, before I start Nex, there is an item that I would like to get. Well, <laughs> rather, there's an item I would like to have. I don't want to get it, but that is a Blood Fury. Now, I have a Blood Fury, but it needs to be recharged, so that means I need Blood Shards. Now, you can get Blood Shards by killing Vyres, but I would prefer to get them by pickpocketing. If you pickpocket a Blood Shard with the full Rogues outfit, you get two of them at once, which is really nice. The problem is, pickpocketing Vyres sucks. Even at 99 Thieving, your base success rate is like 50%. Now, I am going to get by with a little help from my friends, if you will. The Dodgy Necklace and Shadow Veil. I feel like people don't know about these things necessarily, so... The Dodgy Necklace is an Opal Necklace that gives you a 25% chance to prevent you from being stunned if you fail a pickpocket, which saves time. And then also Shadow Veil, you know, maybe maybe people know about uh, the, the necklaces. Shadow Veil is super underknown. Shadow Veil is a spell on the Archaeus spellbook. You do have to have a Kingdom Divided completed. Uh, but while under the effect of the spell, you have a 15% chance to avoid being stunned while pickpocketing. So between Shadow Veil and the Dodgy Necklace, that's 40% chance that if you fail a pickpocket, you don't get stunned. And that is a lot of time saved, not sitting there waiting for your stun to wear off. And then as far as healing goes, I just use the Redemption Prayer to keep myself alive. Of course, when you get damaged down below 9 HP... It'll heal you back up to 30, you sip a prayer pot, and you go again. Yes! Oh, I actually got some! Yes! I'm spooned as always! Oh my god. I mean, you just, you just sit here and you spam click for so long, you never actually think they're gonna pop up. Okay, so that took me... 1,450 pickpockets, which is... I don't know what 5k divided by 1450 is, but that's like a third of the drop rate or something, so. Let's fucking go, dude! So that's 20,000 blood, blood fury charges, that should last a while. The nice thing is they made it so uh, blood furies can hold, I think, up to 30k in total, so I can actually put both of these on. And now it's got 20,000 charges. Woohoo! I didn't get targeted to tank like a single time at the end there. Oh, a Nihil Horn! Hey, congrats, dude. I'm so jealous! That's the drop I want the most. Fuck. Ooh, a Nihil Horn. You know what? You have a cool RSN, okay? You you deserve the drop just for having the RSN Lunar Isle. It's dope. Oh, I'm tasting your wrath. Oh, Nexling! Oh, Nexling! No way! Where's Hugo? Let's see it. Where's he at? That's crazy. Uh, that's my first time seeing the pet. That's nuts. Sad stuff. <gasps> There's no way Umbra just fucking... God. <laughs> Come on, man. There's no way Umbra just 22's my ass. Okay. Okay. Oh, yes! It's finally not gloves, and it's not even from the next minions. So, <laughs> I've gotten three pairs of ancient ceremonial gloves from the next minions. And now I'm killing mages for kill cannon, and we get a top. Yes, it's useless. I just want it for fashionscape. I'm happy. This is gonna come down to the wire, man. Oh, he's out too. Oh, 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 it's on me. Don't mage. Kill it. Why would you run away? He lured me out when he ran away. Oh my god. <laughs> oh fuck, that scared the shit out of me. 
Okay, so I feel like this clip is too funny not to share, but it requires a bit of explanation. Uh, somebody was talking about my old Zolra guide, so I decided to watch my own Zolra guide from like seven years ago on stream. Now, on this guide, I talk about using Zolandratellis, and the Zolandratellis at the time that I made the video were like 400 GP a piece, which now they're way more expensive. So I grabbed my scroll book and I was going to price check what Zolandratellis are worth now. Do I even have any? I do. No! I wanted to check the value of the scrolls and I tried to take them out of my book. And I click, I tell. <laughs> no! God damn it! <laughs> Are you joking? I gotta get kill count again. No! Oh, Torva Full Helm. Hey, congratulations, known threat. At least I've seen something today. It gives me hope. Drops do exist. I can't believe it. Man's is just leaving his... He's, he's leaving his ancient ceremonial legs on the floor over there. I, w I want those bitches, man. That's fashion scape. Uh, I have plate legs and, uh, van braces. I mean, you know, 68. Oh! <gasps> Whoa! Oh, he literally died! He died, but he didn't die! If you go through and they kill you, you auto live. That's wild! <laughs> what? <laughs> I've never seen that shit before. You have no idea. I, I feel like I am unreasonably excited about these useless ancient ceremonial pieces. <laughs> and I don't know, I just I just want the full set so bad. It does nothing for me, and I, I'm just so happy. Okay, so there is the mask. So I've got I've got uh what did I have a bunch of before? Gloves, I think. So I've got the mask, the top, and the gloves. If I get the if I get the bottoms now, I'm set. Torva plate legs. Is that a unique? Is that a unique for he's done? Oh, that's that's your last drop? If so, that's super cool. <laughs> he's saying what? He's uh, it's gotta be he's gotta be done. He's so happy. Brandon gets a plate body. <gasps> God damn it! The fucking Nihil shard and the fucking beam of the- Ah! Oh! That is just- I- I'm actually mad. That- oh, that baited me so hard! This right here is probably as close as I will ever get to a Nex solo. Well, I mean, I finished the boss off, you know, with only me in the room before, but this one, I finished it off all the way from, like, 400 HP, so, you know, surely you get rewarded for that, right? Nice! We pulled off the solo finish, and it's just double, double rubies! Fuck you, game! Come on! That's my reward! Okay, uh... After my next death, I decided I'd stop and do a couple of master clues. Anything good from those? Oh, no, that's one that I have, of course. Oh, that was my 400th master as well. That is one of the few God Sword ornament kits that I have. The Zamorak and the, uh, well, I have, I have the Sarah one, not on anything. Shit, would have been cool to get one that I don't have, but. And the second one is just terrible. Come back here, Crystal and Bling. Gimme, 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 gimme. I still don't have a signet. Let's fucking go. I, you know, I actually have no clue what this thing does. I'm not gonna lie to you. I could not tell you. Uh, it's two mil though, so it must be okay. Um, 
I don't know if I can't tase your recorder or open either, so, uh, hi there, Twitch clip watchers on the YouTube video. Let me look at what this thing does. When worn, it offers a 10% chance to not use a charge when using crystal equipment. Huh. I don't think that I'm ever going to use that, but that's kind of cool. I mean, if you don't have, like, a better ring, and in some scenarios, I could see that being relevant, so. Eh, collection log slot either way. Neat. And I did another full day of necks, and sadly, I did not see anything, and of course, did not get anything in my name. My next kill count right now is 767. I started the video at about 550 kill counts, so... Oh, goodness me, we did over 200 next trios this video, and we didn't get anything, so maybe our, uh, maybe our next luck has dried up after the strong start, who knows. I am about due for a third drop. As you can see on my collection log, I've got a bit over a thousand Nihil shards. And uh, you should expect to get a next unique in your name every 300 Nihil shards. That's the best metric to go by, not kill count. Because if you go by kill count, you don't know if it's in a mass or not. But because the amount of Nihil shards you get, like, scales based on your team size. You know, if you do a trio and you get shards, you're going to get like 30. If you're in a mass and you get shards, you're gonna get like three. So it scales no matter what the team size is, so we are about due for a third item, but uh, hey, maybe next video. Please, for the love of God, make it purple. Yes! Thank you, God, for... <laughs> Thank you for hearing my prayers. Oh, that's a dry streak broken. I, li I don't, I literally don't care what it is. It's... I don't know how dry I am, but it feels like an eternity. If it's an arcane, I'm fine. Well, that's <laughs> slightly better than an arcane, whatever. At least we're on the board again, man. My my brain my brain was in some need of some happy juice, man. Whoa! Whoa! That was sweet! That was- that was sweet! That was- oh my god. Let's run it back in slow-mo. I'm officially coining this the Mammal Crab Trick Shot. That's right, FaZe Clan. Fucking recruit your boy. Let's go! As you were all aware, I would not describe myself as particularly good at this game, so my raids are normally pretty casual, uh, but I did happen to get a, uh, a fast raid layout, and I figured, well, you know, I haven't actually gone for a new PB since getting my Shadow of Tumakin, and that should allow me to get a way faster raid completion time, and it turns out I did. Uh, on this raid, I beat my previous personal best, which I want to say was... Like, 18 minutes and 40 seconds or something like that. Damn it! There was no pop-up, so if it must have been 17.30 for the GM time. Fuck! I missed it by, like, 15 seconds, but... I mean, that definitely is a new PB for me, though. 17 minutes and 47 seconds. It's the power of the shadow, baby. Maybe it's Elg. We do, we do have big horns, yeah. You'll find them in the Badlands. Well, fuck me. Is it- Oh, it's actually healing too! Fuck you! You- Whoa! It's fine. I don't even care. I don't even care. It's fine. I don't- I- I, I don't care. Whatever. I need my crossbow to kill it right here. I'm gonna die. Fuck! 11 health! Mocha! Your magic! It wor- Mocha! It worked! I- 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 you told me to dab when it died and it- it worked! You're fucking magical! <laughs> That's so lame! Now I have to put a clip of me dabbing into a YouTube video. Fuck. Oh, jeez. Hello, little Mr. Squirrel. What did we get? Ah! Oh, why is it always a fucking prayer scroll, man? 
Why is it always a prayer scroll, ICBA? This fucking game, man. Will Nex give me my third unique? Will I get a drop from Cox that isn't a prayer scroll? Find out next time on the Iron Mammal Progress series. <laughs> uh, but for real, thanks all very much for uh, tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, feel free to leave a like, and I will see you all soon.